welcome back to my channel so today I'm going to be doing a Lush haul yes I went to Lush for the first time ever and it was a great experience um, yeah so I actually went to, the first time I went was a few days before Christmas because I wanted to buy some of my friends a few things from there and I ended up buying myself some things as well and I just fell in love with it I had to go back I literally went back a few days after <laughs> I went back um, yesterday which was Monday the day after Christmas um, and they had a sale going on they had their um, buy one get one free and they also had a 50% off on select items like the holiday items so yeah I went to go check that out and I, I bought some other things that were not on sale so yeah I'm going to show you guys what I purchased from Lush so there are a few things that I did start using because I just couldn't help myself um, but yeah, I'm gonna show you what I got. So, let's see. So the first thing I got, the first day I went, was the Cup O Coffee. It's a face and body mask. Cup O Coffee. Focus. Cup O Coffee. So... It's a face and body mask, a rich and robust mask with ground coffee to leave skin radiant and smooth. And this has actual coffee beans inside. It smells so good, so good. Like I cannot get enough of the smell, honestly. I don't drink coffee. I stopped drinking coffee because it gives me, it gives me anxiety but I do love the smell so I'm just one in my mouth <laughs> but yeah I tried this out three times and I did feel a difference afterwards my face was nice and exfoliated it just felt really fresh clean and I don't know if I was just like bugging out or something but um the first day that I tried it um, I noticed that I just had like this burst of energy it, kind of, it just reminded me like if I drank a cup of coffee which I found really weird but um I don't know I didn't get knowing I didn't get anxiety afterwards but yeah that's what happened to me but I really do like this product I have yet to try it on my body I've only tried it on my face I'm gonna see if I try it on my body, but so far I do like what it's done to my face. I feel like it does look more bright and just like fresh and clean, which I like. And it doesn't dry out my skin, which is great because my skin has been really dry lately because of the cold weather on well, my face. My body has been pretty dry too. That's another reason why I had to go back to Lush because I was like, I need to get some really moisturizing things. Okay. Next thing, something else I got from the Lush store is the the Razzle Dazzle. It's a luxury bath oil. It's melting in my hands. <laughs> but yeah, it smells really good. Like raspberries, berries. Oh yeah, I have their pamphlet. I had to. Okay, so yeah, I'm excited to try that. I have tried one of their bath oils. I tried the Floating Island. Um, I actually split that one into twos. So I tried it one night, and then the next night I tried the other half. I did like it. I feel like the first night, it, it only kept me moisturized for the night that I was sleeping. But I think it's because I used like a really small piece. And then the second time, I used the, the rest of it, which was a lot bigger. And I feel like it did moisturize my skin for a good amount of time. So I guess with those, it would be better to use a larger amount or just like the whole thing. So yeah, 
Let's see, what else did I get? So the next thing I got is the Buffy. It's a body butter bar. Is that what it's called? Body butter bars, yes. Buffy. This one I did use, I couldn't help myself. I used it two times in one day. So, this is also melting in my hands. It smells so good, like, you can smell the cocoa butter. I smell some lemon in there. Let's see, what does it have? It has, it says buffs away dry skin with ground almonds and rice for bright, softened bodies. This is something that I definitely did need because my skin has been so dry because of my skin virus that I talked about in my previous video. So you guys, if you guys are interested on in knowing like what I'm talking about, you can go to you know my previous videos. Um, and I'll also put the link in the description for that video. But yeah, because of that, my skin has been extremely dry. I'm actually clear of the virus now. I think I'm like 98% clear. My skin, I don't see any of the spots anymore. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, my skin has been extremely dry because of that skin virus. So I was like, I need something to moisturize my skin. So I got that um body butter bar and i love it love 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 it like i'm gonna have to buy another one because i can see that running out pretty soon even though it's a big bar i mean i don't know that's just what i'm thinking it'll probably last a long time but yeah i did use that i couldn't wait it's great you guys should get it if your skin is dry i got the movi facial soap bar I tried this last night, excuse me, and this morning. Um, so when I went into Lush, I, I asked the lady, like, can you recommend a soap to me, a face soap that will keep my face moisturized? And she recommended this to me. She tested it out on my hand, and I liked how it felt. It left it nice, smooth, clean. So. This is made with whole wheat bread and fair trade organic cacao butter and it's made to nourish and gently cleanse and that's exactly what it did. <laughs> it, the smell is interesting. I don't know, I feel like it's a smell that not everyone would like. It's okay to me, you know. It just has um, a strong... What is it that it has? It just has a strong whole wheat smell to it. Which is not bad. I also smell some lemon in there. But yeah, I feel like a lot of people won't really like this scent. It doesn't bother me. It's okay. But yeah. Um, so it has like the whole... So it looks like a loaf of bread. It's so funny. <laughs> like, look at this. I don't know if it's focusing guys, I'm so sorry. Oh my god, I don't think it is. That's so bad. It's like focusing on my face. But yeah, that's the texture. And I really like how these this right here, this is like the whole wheat part of it. I mean it's all combined inside, but it's like out here. Um, I really like how it exfoliates my skin and my, my skin just feels like fresh, clean, I love it, it's great, so yeah, you guys should try this out if you have dry skin. What else did I get? Let's see, the other thing I got is the Yogue Log Roulette. It's a body soap. Okay. I don't know why I'm showing you guys that. 
I have not used this yet. It's still sealed. So this is a body soap. Again, I asked the lady at the Lush store if she could recommend something that will moisturize my skin because it's been very dry. And she recommended this to me and this was actually one of the bars. Sorry, my dog is doing like something really weird right now. Anyways, um, <laughs> so yeah, this is one of the bars she recommended to me and this one was actually on sale. It's part of their holiday collection. What happened, Toby? You want to be in the video? You want to be in the video? Toby wants to be in the video. Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. <laughs> He's so funny. He's such an attention whore. But yeah. This soap, I cannot find in the pamphlet. But yeah, she, I forgot what she told me, but she just said it's very moisturizing. And just from the feel of it, it feels very moisturizing. Um, I think she told me that it has uh, cocoa butter in it. So yeah, I'm super excited to try this out. So yeah, this was on sale. It was 50% off. Um, what is this? This is 0.15 pounds. I paid $6.75 for this. But yeah, and this is what it looks like. It's like melting in my hands right now. But it, the scent, it has a strong cocoa butter scent to it. To, to tell you guys what it smells like it's just like cocoa butter I don't know I'm sorry guys I don't I can it's just a very strong cocoa butter smell and I'm I feel like there's some lemon in here too it's like there's lemon in everything yeah super excited to try that out and I'm pretty happy I got it 50% off. That's great. I also got this facial moisturizer. Let's see. Can you see it? Can you see it? Focus. There it is. Imperialis. That is what it's called. I originally when I went, I wanted to get the skin drink because the first time I went to Lush, um, the lady that had helped me, she actually tested it out on my um, hands and I really loved how it felt. But when I was there, I just totally forgot the name and for some reason I thought it was this one. Um, but the first time I went, she did give me a sample of the skin drink and I actually tried it on today for the first time and I love it. like. Usually, so it left my skin really fresh looking. My nose usually oils up, like a lot of oil builds up on my nose. And with this, I noticed that there was no oil at all. And I was just like, what? How, like how is this happening right now? Because you don't understand how for how long I've been trying to find something to stop that. So yeah, I'm probably gonna go back to get the skin drink I have not tried this yet I'm hoping it does me good but um again the lady told me this is for dry skin it um it's all it says soothes soften and brighten with this common lavender and orange blossom cream cream its balancing effects makes it lovely for skin with a split personality so, 
this is meant to balance the skin so I guess it's good for all skin types so I'm, I'm sure it'll be good but um I'll let you guys know I'll probably make a video letting you guys know what I think about these products like a review a lush review so yeah probably gonna try this out tomorrow oh let me open it let me show you guys what it looks like Okay, that's what it looks like. It's like a very light beige color. The scent is very mild. I do smell some rose water in there. Is that a rose water? Wait, I think I read that in the front. There, let me see. No. It doesn't have rose water. Sorry, guys. What am I smelling? It's a very mild smell. I don't know. I'm so bad at this, guys. But it's very mild, which I like for the face, at least. Next is the Butterball Bath Bomb. Butterball Bath Bomb. It's a Butterball Bath Bomb. I meant bomb. Oh my god, sorry. I'm such a mess. I just got home from work. I went like a 11 hour shift today, so <laughs> I'm out of it. Don't mind me. It smells really good. Like, the name fits this. Butterball. Oh, it has a really nice vanilla scent to it. Very warm, sweet vanilla. Yeah. I don't know if you guys can see, but it's um, it's white. Sorry, guys. This is this is not focusing. It's white, and it has like. Alright, this is not working. So. I'm just going to describe what it looks like. So, um, yes, it's white and it has a few spots of different colors. Like, I see a little bit of blue, yellow. That's basically it. But yeah, I'm excited to try this because I've never tried a bath bomb, so that should be fun. And the reason why I got this is because it's white. I don't really want something that's going to dirty my shower like not stain it but you know I don't want to have to like go crazy cleaning it after I shower I take a bath so I got one of these fun bar thingy my bobbers um, this one is called reindeer and robin this is Make a pair of woodland creatures or superheroes that smell of sweet cola. Um, so yeah, I just got this because it was part of the buy one get one free deal. They had buy one get one free on their bath bombs, but only the holiday ones and I only liked one out of all of them. And I thought this was buy one get one, wait what was it, buy one get one free. So I was like, let me try this out. This is pretty cool. So basically, I think these are, you're just like supposed to throw them in the shower. Well, you can create things with them. Fun, woo! And um, then after that, you can just throw them in the water and you can have like a bubble bath. But yeah, I'm, I'm pretty excited to try this, honestly. So this is what it looks like. So there's red, yellow, white, and there's this like brown, orangish one, and it, it looks like chocolate chips. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm gonna smell it. Let's see, I haven't even opened it to smell it. Oh, it it smells like Coca-Cola. That's so weird. <laughs> okay. So what's up with the chocolate chips? I don't get it. <laughs> yeah, 
Yes, I got this. So this was buy one get one 50% off or I think it was, oh no, sorry guys. It wasn't buy one get one 50% off. It was buy one get one free. I think I said that earlier, sorry. Like I said, I'm out of it right now. Oh my god, sorry guys. Yeah, I really love these little stickers that they have. It like tells you the name of the creator and when it was made and by what to use by like what day. That's pretty cool. So I also got this guys. It is the Snow Angel bath bomb sorry guys my camera shut off but yeah this is the snow angel bath bomb it's like shimmery and then it's white and shimmery on the other side this this smells really good guys like so it smells heavenly it smells heavenly <laughs> so this one is actually moisturizing which is awesome perfect I need this in my light and it's shimmery so it's just gonna make everything fun in the bathtub you know and it smells so good but yeah uh this one i got for free because it the this bath bomb costs less than the um the fun the thing i showed you what is it the fun bubble bath thingy my bobbers this thing this is more expensive than the bath bomb so i got the bath bomb for free i spent a good $80 uh, the second time I went so the only thing I didn't get yesterday which was worth $80 um, I didn't get this I did not get the cup of coffee I got that the first time I went and I also this I did not get yesterday I got this uh, the first time I went as well as the butter ball bath bomb. I did not get this one yesterday. So, yeah, I spent a good $80 on everything but those three things I just showed you, which I think is pretty good, you know? I mean, it would have been more if they didn't have, if I didn't get the soap 50% off and if I didn't get that free uh, bath bomb. But yeah, I feel like, as of now, I feel like their products aren't worth it. I have to see how I feel in the long run since I just started using some of their products. If you guys have any favorite products from Lush, let me know in the comments down below because I'm interested. I want to know what you guys like, what works for you. So yeah guys, that's everything that I got from Lush. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll probably be making a Lush review video pretty soon. Just let me know if you guys are interested in watching that and I'll definitely make a video based on that. And yeah, just let me know in the comments what you think about this video. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and if you want to see more um, hauls doesn't have to be only lush it could be food hauls anything you know, just let me know in the comments come on communicate with me sorry um so yeah that's everything like i said i hope you guys enjoyed the video give this video a thumbs up leave some comments down below and don't forget to subscribe if you guys haven't done so already thank you so much for watching bye guys